you know, I'm beginning to think I might want a slightly better plan B. Is that a skiba? So I'm back in a sewer. It's a different one this time. You know, it's it's something a little new, I guess. The sewers of White Run. But I can't say it's going to be a particularly pleasant experience because it's a sewer. I mean, you know, you, you can have variety in your sewer visitations and it's still going to be a tunnel filled with, well, Yes. Is that a dog? I'm hearing a dog. As well as rats and mud, mud crabs. I probably should not go out the way I came in. There was actually a guard looking at that point when I dashed out of the huntsman. After he caught me picking pockets. You know, I really should be able to just knock them on the back of the head. All right, we're getting across there without stepping in, well, everything. Is there anything over there? Oh, 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 I can, ah, I can leave. White run that way. That is interesting, isn't it? Yes, it is. Uh, there are no other exits. Oh, mind you, I should be looking up to find exits, should I not? Oh, do I really have to wade through? Yes, I do. I mean, I sort of feel like I should be able to uh, just knock people out. Smack them on the back of the head. This is where that spell of forget the stupid thing we did would come in useful, right? Alright, you know, seeing as we're already here and... Aha. Uh -huh. Yes. Okay, don't think about it. Don't think about it. I mean... I tell you what I do have. I have a spell toe to White Run Burrows. I'm getting a sort of feeling that that's definitely not where I want to go. Um, yeah, I've got a spell tome to calm people. Would that work? Would that actually work? If I could learn how to cast a spell, could I, could I be like, there is nothing wrong. Wave my fingers. There is nothing wrong. Go away. And they would go away. C could I do that to somebody who's discovered me picking pockets? Because that would be very useful. Yes, it would. Okay. Who are you? I don't know if they've seen me and just don't care. Let's just be ready for anything. Possibly should just... Possibly should just uh, introduce myself. I could use an invisibility potion. Hello. Hello, stray dog. Ah, uh, and... Tringway the Tramp. Hello? Yes? Ah, uh, here, have a gold piece. Maybe. Oh, thank you. Divines bless your kind heart. All right, then. This is where you're supposed to... The gift of charity has been... Give the what? I was going to say, this is where you're supposed to turn around and say something. Ooh, speech craft increased by 10 points for an hour. Oh, so if I give beggars coins, I become, oh, such a nice person. 
No, it's tradition though, when you give a beggar a coin, he says something like, By the way, avoid the way on the left, and go right, and you'll find treasure, or something. I know how this works. I've read the books. The Song of Ulvak. Okay. Ah, uh, oh. Oh, that I I've already got a uh, perk to uh, sort out. Yes, I do. I'm sort of waiting until I get a little better at alchemy. White one sewers, wind district. This is probably the way to do this. I'll go into the wind district sewers and then come up there and perhaps get changed. Do I have a set of clothing that is not the nightingale? We're probably going to have more rats. All right, you know what? I'd rather be able to see. Ah, that would be a way. Okay, skeevers, skeevers. Can I hit you from here? Yes, is the answer. Is there just one entrance here? Or... Maybe there's more. I'll tell you what. We don't really care too much. What is in there? <sighs> go away. Definitely go away. Is there a way across? What? Oh, God. Hello, peddler. You scared me. Uh, oh. Take a look. Do you buy? You don't buy stolen stuff, do you? No, you don't. You've got 809. God, how the hell are you doing business that, you know what? Never mind. Doesn't matter. Here, buy some of my stuff. How All right, very odd. Okay, so you just stay down here, buying and selling from people who... Is that a hobby of yours or something? I mean, just, you know. Okay. All right. That's for annoying me. Right, so... Let's see. Oh. If they're still looking for me. Okay, let's just hide. Just in case they are. And then. Uh, oh, I do actually have the, uh, the nice clothes, the fine clothes. I shall slip into those and then go and fetch. Hello. Fetch Inigo. I was thinking what we should do is get out of Dodge and go to Falkreath. But actually, that's kind of suspicious, you know. Leaving the gate and going to the carriage and hot tailing it out of there. Okay, there's a guard, there's a guard, there's a guard. Is, is often a bad idea. You want to just look casual. Right, I know it's the middle of the night and I'm probably wet and... Oh, God, I'm probably... I'll tell you what, let's just... Wash as much of the sewer off ourselves as possible and then change into the nice clothing. So, yeah, totally and utterly failed to get any more sweet rolls. Uh, although, all things considered, that might be... Uh, a good at how many do you have? Pooling our resources. Wait, well, you're already carrying a lot of the stuff. I'm just you've only got two left. You've been snaffling them quite quickly, actually. Maybe we should any thoughts? Look at us, an Imperial and a Khajiit bringing order to the land side by side. We are a credit to civilization. Bringing order to the Empire. 
Okay, that's one way of looking at it. I suppose, in, in a way, uh, I am attempting to bring some sort of order. On my way. Uh, I have pins and needles. Okay. Uh, yeah, right. Let's get to Falkrieth and... Um, We'll just stay in character for now. This is Janessa, yes. Hi! I actually was uh, considering hiring her before I met you. I mean, you know, I don't need to, obviously, now. You're far better company, I'm sure. But, uh, you know, she seemed... I can't remember what it was. I think it was, I think it was her attitude that just, just sort of impressed me. It was a uh, no-nonsense, business-like, and, um... Well reasonably violent, which in, in this line of work is a useful trait. Well, it's not raining, so that's a thing. You know, I do feel, well, more comfortable now in this outfit, or even the nightingale armor, than I do the fine raiments from that shop. I, I, I need to spend a little more time in fine clothing because I need to stay comfortable using it. Sometimes it's important to wear items of clothing like that and look like you were born to wear it. People have a sense for that, you know. If you're wearing something that's just um, new, they pick up on it. Could you please stop running through me while I'm talking to you? I mean, it's one thing to have people who just look straight through you when you're having a conversation. It's another to have them just run straight into your face. So, we see... Oh, she's right there. We see Astri. You're back. Good. All right, so, did you meet this motier? What did he want? Um, you're not going to believe this, but he would like us to kill the Emperor. You're joking. Do I look like the humorous type? Well, actually, I can be, but but no, I'm not. Show Astri the amulet and sealed letter. What's this? It's an amulet and a sealed letter. By Sithis, you're not joking. To kill the Emperor of Tamriel. The Dark Brotherhood hasn't done such a thing since the assassination of Pelagius. As a matter of fact, no one has dared assassinate an Emperor of Tamriel since the murder of Uriel Septim, and that was 200 years ago. Well, then uh, it's about high time, right? I mean, we're, we're, we're out of practice, yeah? I mean, this, this would be a statement, Astrid. This would, this would let the world know we were back. It would uh, allow us a little more influence. It could also shake things up. It's, it's always a dangerous thing, isn't it, when you kill someone that high up the food chain. You could bring the wrong sort of attention to us. But I think that the, the client is the sort of person that we might be able to do business with in future, or at least take care of if we need to. Surely the Night Mother wouldn't misdirect us, is basically what I'm saying. No, she certainly wouldn't. And, for whatever reason, she chose to relay Motier's information to you. I don't know exactly what's going on here, if you're the listener, or this is some fluke, or what. But what we now have before us... ...is an opportunity. So, we'll accept the contract? <laughs> you're damn right we'll accept it. If we pull this off, the Dark Brotherhood will know a fear and respect we haven't seen in centuries. Now you you're talking I'd my language. Abandon an opportunity to lead my family to glory. But this is all so much to take in. I need time to read the letter and figure out where we go from here. And this amulet. Hmm. What? What? What about the amulet? What is there? Something about the amulet that's there to cover costs. It is an odd way to pay for costs, isn't it? It means something, doesn't it? What are you thinking? I'm thinking we need that amulet appraised. I want to know where it came from, how much it's worth, and if we can actually get away with selling it. And there's only one man who can give us what we need. Delvin Mallory. 
As I know offense, the man. A private operator. I also know that. Works out of the Ratway in Riften. Give me the letter. I'm wearing Bring Mallory thieves' guild armor. Find out everything you can and sell it if he's willing. He'll offer a letter of credit. That's fine. Delvin Mallory and the Dark Brotherhood have... Uh -huh, history. He can be trusted. I know he can be trusted. Tr I'm stood here in Guild Master Arm... How I, I just, I wonder if it's a test or if, if, you know, somehow. What, what am I hearing? Three wood elves and a hatchet. Points for creativity, if nothing else. You give me too much credit. Or how could I fail? I am, after all, just a little girl. What threat could I possibly pose? Ha <laughs> ha. <laughs> okay, so sometimes listening to their stories can be amusing. This one wasn't. Right, uh, guys, I need to buy and sell stuff. Oh, My God. My targets make the mistake of not perceiving me as a threat. Last mistake they ever make. Yeah, I probably should have sold some of the stuff in um, in Whiterun as well. However, you know, I'm, I'm heading back to Riften. So, oh, any advice on my current contract? The man you need to speak with. His name is Motier. That's a very old and powerful... Ah, you're still talking about that one. We, we've moved on. Sincere, we've moved on. Most curious. You're living in the past, which is understandable. You are a vampire. However, let's... Uh, oh, a bit of this and a bit of that. Let's just offload some junk. I'm not saying I'm bored of riding the same two paths back to White Run every time I want to get a carriage. What I'm saying is I'm ridiculously bored of taking the same two paths back to White Run each time I want a carriage. We have got, we have absolutely got to look into that whole carriage company idea. I think we'd make a killing. No pun intended, all things considered. It does look very impressive in this weather. I, I, there is something about white run and fog and mist. It's just very atmospheric. Oh my God, there's a lot of water today. This, this is what happens when you get rain up in the mountains. It comes down and starts making all the rivers travel so much faster. It's a constant reminder that nature is bloody powerful. Something you need? Anything for the guild? Yeah, this is actually Dark Brotherhood business. Oh. Oh, I see. Well, you're making friends all over. Well, you? that's so, the plan. Uh, how is Astrid doing these days? Tell her to stop by sometime. We can have a drink. Catch up. Ah, but business, of course. What kind of business? Right, yeah. What can you tell me about this? Let's see. Where, oh, where did you get this? No, don't answer. I don't want to know. This is an amulet of the Emperor's Elder Council. Specially crafted for each member. We have a small fortune. Ain't something you give up lightly. Look, it ain't my business to tell the Dark Brotherhood it's business. But if you killed a member of the Elder Council, you better believe. Uh, yeah, but believe what? That we're in trouble? We didn't. Does this mean this guy is a part of the Elder Council? Would you buy it? Probably not. Buy it? This? An Elder Council amulet? Yeah, you can't... Oh, yes. Oh, you will? Oh, yes, indeed. Oh, wait. Just one moment. Here is a letter of credit, usable by Astrid only, for any service or item I can provide, as per our standard arrangement. You bring that back to your lovely mistress, with my regards. Oh, I to say you've got the skills to be a thief. It's another to actually use them. You do know I'm the Guildmaster, right? Now I've picked up my improved 
Crimson Archer gear. It does look nice, doesn't it? It really does. And it even suits Linway's hood. It's, it's stylish and yet does not scream, I am a thief. Oh, before we go anywhere, before we go anywhere, I want to use the uh, the alchemy station. Yes. Yeah. What I need to do now is go and chat with the wizard in the in the Jarl's castle, palace, whatever it is. And I, I need to use this. Excuse me, I need to use this. And get her to enchant no. them. Name your poison. And then we will have... I, I want to use this. Yes, someone else is using it, but get out of my way. Yeah, we'll get it enchanted, and then I'm going to use this as my um, gentleman around town outfit. Okay, I made it to 70 alchemy, which is enough now to get pure mixture. I can remove any negative effects from potions and positive effects from poisons. That is very nice. I also have a perk that I can spend on yeah, twice as many potions at the advanced lab. That is a uh, that is nice. That will allow me to make tons of, uh, The problem is is I already make probably more potions and poisons than I can sell. I end up with tons of them lying around. But there are some potions I'm not I don't have a lot of them. Night vision, specifically. This would really help keep a good supply of night vision potions. So that is a possibility. It is It is on my list of things. However, what else was there? On the run, still not totally convinced by that. But I do want Stalk the Prey. What was Trickster? Can pickpocket equipped weapons. If the target is sleeping, can equip pickpocket any item. <laughs> nice, but honestly, I'm usually interested in picking the smaller items anyway. The other thing I've been thinking about taking was Problem Solver. Sneak attacks deal 10% more damage for each 200 points of health the target has. This would mean against really tough opponents... Breaking invisibility with a power attack is a guaranteed critical strike. That's, oh, that would be nice as well. Go invisible and then do a massive attack. Th this one just seems to be a very good idea against those super tough enemies. And we've had one or two of them. Usually I can kill them on the second hit. Maybe. But I cannot help but feel this is probably where I should be going. Yes, indeed. So I think I'm going to. I like the title as well. Do you know what's really worrying? The fact that I'm actually missing my little... Guildmaster, good to see you. Oh, uh, good to see you too. Um, Is it Vipper? Is it Vipper? Or is it Thrin? Tr it's, it's the one beginning... Thrin! You wanna talk to me? No, no, I'm I'm good, I'm good, okay. I'm good. Just 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 if I've been a while and I'm not great with names. Um Yeah, I miss this. It's not even a room. It's a bed, but it has sheets and a tiny bit of privacy. It it shows you how bad the Brotherhood Sanctuary is. That I'm thinking back to a sewer as the glory days. We have got to get a house. Some houses. I should have a house in every single city. I'm rich. I don't know how much houses cost. But if they cost more than I've got, I'll steal more. It's just ridiculous that I'm, you know, living in such appalling conditions, all things considered. The nightshade never grows back here. Have you ever noticed that? It never grows back here. That is really weird. I have made everything I need to make potion-wise. I've 
given the Crimson Archer armor that had been improved by the blacksmith to the sorceress to enchant a little. We're getting a little closer to having Wait. a decent out. I know you. Wait, that's usually a bad sign. Let's be on our way. So what is Good, you're back. Well, what did Mallory have to say? Is the amulet authentic? Uh it's beyond authentic. It's slightly worrying and exciting all at the same time. Made for the members of the Elder Council. The Elder Council? The Elder Council. Oh, now that explains quite a bit. Motier, you naughty, naughty boy. Hiring the Dark Brotherhood to help you rise beyond your station. Delicious. Was Mallory willing to buy the amulet? Uh, yes. Splendid. Then we're ready to begin. Or, more specifically, you're ready to begin. After all, you're the one the Night Mother spoke to. Now then, I hope you have something nice to wear, because you're going to a wedding. Oh, oh okay. I, weddings are okay, I suppose. Well, more like the public reception. It should be a lovely affair. You'll mingle with the guests, eat some cake, stab the bride. Oh, yes. You've got to kill the bride at her wedding. And they say romance is dead. Oh, enough talk. Just tell me who to kill. Who is the target? Her name is Vittoria Vici. She oversees the East Empire Company's business holdings in solitude. The wedding is being held in that city. At the Temple of the Divines, her death will cause an uproar, which is exactly what we want. Vici is likely to address her guests frequently, as is the wedding custom. Kill her when she does that, and I promise you a significant bonus. Now go, and give my best to the bride. Okay, then. Represent us well, brother. I will do my best kill someone whilst they are at their wedding and it's not like like just someone sat at the back it's the bride this will probably be difficult it will require skill and finesse i should seek for advice from well some of them brother any advice on my current contract your contract sounds simple, which means it certainly will not be. Getting into that reception will be easy, but have you thought about getting out? Not much, but I plan on thinking about that quite a lot. Yes, Until I... next time, brother. All right. Oi. Mr. Swingy Axe. You're part of a family now, Hamshank. I trust you, you trust me. Got it? Yeah, I don't suppose by any minor miracle you have some advice on the latest contract. You gotta kill a soft little woman on her wedding day. Here What's we go. next? Murdering a crippled orphan in his sleep? No, we're going to be murdering a high-profile person whilst the powerful people in, I think it's Solitude, will be watching. And I have to kill her right in front of them. But no, no, you're absolutely right. It's soft Take and easy. Go go first. back to murdering these straw dummies. I'm sure they will put up a really good and interesting fight. To be outnumbered 20 to 1. You give me too much credit. For how can oh. I fail? I am, after all, Gabriella. Death is but the time to sleep forever in the void. Very nice. Uh, but... I hope you don't mind, but I took the liberty of surveying the site of the reception. Ooh, I don't There's mind. a small parapet just opposite the balcony that would prove an excellent spot for a long-range kill. Um, I left something there for you, if you're inclined to take that approach. Uh, okay, I'm not. A, I'm not a really good shot, and I'm reluctant to um, tell Inigo to take the shot because 
Well, he's awfully good at shooting things on his own accord, but whenever yeah, I've told him to do something, he has a horrible habit of, um, well, interpreting my commands in an interesting way. No, in my luck, I'd say, go shoot that woman, and, and he'd jump off the, uh, whatever it is, run through the crowd, smash a something? cake into her face or something. Did she, do you have to meet him to understand. Like a child. No one ever suspects a thing. It's no fair. I love weddings. Astrid should have given this contract to me. Instead, she's got me visiting cities and assessing security. How bored. Well, did you... But listen, I think I can help you. The wedding reception is outside the Temple of the Divines, right? In solitude? I believe so. Tell me, if so, the bride the will probably true. address the crowd from the balcony. Ah, it overlooks the courtyard. Adventure. Well, there's an yes. old statue there. By I've six, seen it. Hanging right over where well, she'll be standing. Well, old means weak. Weak means fall. Hmm? Oh, I like you your found? thinking, you adorable contract. little vampire. Feeble. There is more knowledge in me than in two of you pups put together. And knowledge, knowledge is my weapon. Well, knowledge and fire and other forms of brutal elemental death, I assume. You like creeping round in the shadows? Magical work I doesn't like go it. there as anywhere else. Yeah, yeah. Uh, any advice? No, killing her will be easy. She'll be so happy she'll never see it coming. I should know. I killed a bride once. Who's our honeymoon? <laughs> tepid, I said. The bathwater <laughs> should be tepid. Lukewarm <laughs> is not tepid. Close, <laughs> maybe, but there is a difference. Oh. Uh, Stupid cow. That was really helpful advice. Thank you very much. Uh, so what you're saying is I should Fireball. marry her myself and Never then murder wrong. her Your on the honeymoon when she does something annoying. Story. Yes, very, very helpful, oh, and yet... You mean in that... Uh, Manor house. Oddly endearing. <laughs> uh, what can I say? It happened just like you heard. But really, a horker, some twine, three wood elves, and a hatchet? Points for creativity, if nothing else. Now a child could have accomplished it. Such is the power of the arcane. If you only knew of the spells I didn't use. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Okay, I, I, I want details of that story. I definitely want de Hello, Nazir. Will uh, there ever come a time when the people of Skyrim no longer need our services? Ah. Uh, I think not. I was going to say, yes, when they're all dead. It's, it's a sad truth, but wherever you have more than one person in close proximity to someone else, you've probably got someone who wants somebody killed. Uh, I, I, I heard that somewhere once and now i'm getting an odd odd image of a jar filled with urine for some bizarre reason um okay um any advice slaughtering the emperor's cousin at her wedding those guards will be out for blood wouldn't surprise me if the crowd jumped in too that's not really much advice that's that's don't get caught by the crowd or murder them all can I murder them all? Could I not just poison the wedding cake? I mean, the the, the problem is, is they they want this done at the uh, at the where she gives a speech thing, and she's probably not going to be giving speech with a mouthful of cake. So, out of curiosity, do we have any more? Content? There are indeed oh. three to be exact. I probably shouldn't get distracted. There's Deacus, a shipwreck scavenger. Mirandru Joe, a traveling caravaner. And a Noriath, a hunter. Have I met Deacus? I can't just not. Okay, tell me about Marunda Joe. He's an accomplished wizard. Ooh. And locating him may be challenging as he travels with the caravans. All right. Yeah, I passed one on the way here. Sold them some extra potions that I had about me. I didn't really pay attention to the names, though. Where was that? I think it's as we passed Windhelm, yes. Uh, tell me about Decus. He's an Argonian layabout. Likes to scaven shipwrecks. My guess is he'll run if threatened. Or swim, if given the chance. 
So don't threaten him, then, is what you're saying. Just kill him. Get on with it and kill him. Tell me about Anoriath. The Wood Elf may run a stall in the city, but he retreats to the plains outside Whiterun to hunt. Kill him there, and no one will bear witness. Okay, outside of Whiterun. Well, uh, yeah, I can, I can get those done. Happy hunting. Yes, thank you very much. Who else do I need advice for? Probably not you. You're not. You're just going to tell me about that creepy cursed item you want me to make that involves me going places I don't think I can go. Or you're just going to go back to bed at me. Fine. Brilliant. Did not want to talk to you anyway. Spoke to the Argonian. The, the Nord. The Dunmer. The Vampire. The Crazy Old Man. And uh, Nazir. Was there anyone else apart from our crazy friend? I don't think so. But I may have forgot. Hello, how are you? Oh, hello, hello. Uh, do you have any water? You can refill my water. Why can you, of all pe... Oh. Right. God. Did you... Just urinate in my water skins. 